Dale's arena was packed with thousands of people ready to root for the home team. But Valley News team's Veronica Marshall found out Fargo Force players weren't the only ones getting applause. It looks awesome. Way to go, guy. I would just say great job. I mean, they look amazing. Fargo Force fans cheered on 10-year-old Brody Strom. The mastermind behind the team jersey's new design. This is the first time that we've had a patient design the jerseys, um, and it's actually the first Fargo Force game that we've had benefiting Sanford Children's Hospital. I think the jerseys are a huge hit. And she's right. I've been in hockey a lot, and uh, I've never seen anything like it, so it's really exciting for me to see something like this that's totally new, totally uh, different from what a typical jersey looks like. I think it's, uh, it's awesome. It's going to a, a great cause. And it's creative. I absolutely love it. The jerseys Brody designed were auctioned off to raise money for Sanford Children's Hospital. Brody came to mind as he is a pretty amazing kid and um, he put a lot of great detail into the uh, jersey and it, was, it really um, was beyond our expectations. He's just a great role model for other kids. Brody's personal journey with Sanford started when he was just 22 months old when he was diagnosed with stage four lung cancer. Now he's cancer free and giving back. I'm pretty proud that he wanted to be a part of this and um, give back a little bit to the place that helped him so much. In Fargo, Veronica Marshall, Valley News Live. In total, $12,783 was, was donated from the Jersey auction. Ticket sales and the orange Chuck-a-Puck sold for the Carson Wentz Jersey Prize. You can